What's up fellas? Mr. Silva here with another video. Today I'm gonna show you what you really need to start a vinyl decal business. If you want to start a vinyl decal business and you want to quit your full-time job, please don't do that. I want to be honest with you guys. I don't want to sell you the idea of becoming rich overnight. There's no shortcut to successfulness. The only only way to be successful is to work hard. And of course, that takes some time. So if you have your full time job, please keep it and work on your decal business in your spare time. The vinyl decal industry is a wonderful way to start your own business. There's really low overhead and a lot of opportunity for growth. For the sake of this video, I assume you already have a computer with internet connection. The computer can be a laptop or desktop, Windows or Mac. There are five different things you need to consider in order to start your vinyl decal business. Okay, point number one is passion, enthusiasm and dedication. You can do anything as long as you have the passion Either you are a crafty person, you like computers, or you like graphics and you want to make some money. Well, this video is for you. Most people on the vinyl decal industry started their business as a hobby. There is no better feeling that love what you do, and if you can make money, even better. As I mentioned before, this is not an easy path. If you want to start any kind of business, you must work really hard. So dedication is the key for success. But don't worry, cause all the effort will pay off. And if you follow my method, you'll be making money in a few months. Okay, so point number two, you need a vinyl cutter. The two most popular and reliable vinyl cutters on the market are the Silhouette Cameo and the Cricut. Both of them have similar features and they have a really good reviews. In my case, I use the Silhouette Cameo and I'm really happy with it. It is up to you which one you choose. Point number three, you need some supplies. We need some vinyl rolls for sure just different colors. Just don't go too crazy with that. You don't have to carry all colors at the beginning. Just three or four colors should be fine. Later on, you can add few more colors as per customer's request. You also need some transfer tape. We're gonna use it to transfer the finished design. There's different type of transfer tapes, but you can start with the transparent with grids. We also need some masking tape. Point number four, you need some tools. Even the cutter does most of the job. We still need to manually remove the vinyl that's not part of the design. This process is commonly known as weeding. So in fact, you need a weeding tool. You also need a scraper to remove air bubbles between vinyl and transfer tape. We also need a ruler and an exacto knife. Okay, we are going to the last point, which I think is really crucial for the success of the business. So far, you have everything to make a decal. You have a nice decal ready to sell, sitting on your table, but guess what? We don't have a buyer yet. So on point number five, you need a place to sell your decal. You can sell your decals in different places. It could be a craft fair, a swap meet, or even at your local stores. But for this video, we're gonna focus on selling your decals online. You can create your own website and sell your decals, but that's gonna take a lot of work and money. And it's gonna take you 
a way longer to start making money. So we won't consider this option for now. We don't have to worry about it. Two of the most popular online platforms to sell your decals are eBay and Etsy. These two platforms have hundreds of thousands of potential buyers for your decals. They already have the customers ready to buy and you just need to create a seller account, list your decals and start making money. On my future videos, I'm going to go into detail for the five points I mentioned today. So please guys, stay tuned and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss all the information I'm going to share with you. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell so you get all notifications for new content. Thank you for watching. See you on my next video.